Hi, my name is Gordon White, and in this screencast we're going to show you the importance of tagging photos within Photoshop Elements. So what we'll do here is we've got the Photoshop Elements open. If we select Organizer, this now brings up selected photographs that you've chosen from your hard drive. To select new um, photographs, go to File, Get Photos and Videos, and from the drop-down, locate the selection of photographs you want. Now understanding tags is pretty straightforward. By default you have these four categories set. You can add subcategories to these and then tags. To do this, just select from the drop down here. New keyword tag, new subcategory, new category. Now we'll just go through the, the people one. We already have a family one, family subcategory set up by default. What we've done is we've gone ahead and added some um, individual tags. These are all of my daughters. Uh, family one with my wife in as well. So we want to now add the final tag, which would be um, my youngest daughter. So with the family subcategory selected, drop down, new keyword tag, and enter the tag name. In this case, it's my daughter's name. Now we can personalize this further by selecting Edit Icon and then Import. So we want to create the tag with an image. So we'll just locate the image of um, one of my daughters. We'll just say OK and OK again. So now in here we've got our full set of tags that we want within the family. Now it's a case of putting these images with tags. So we know, for instance, the top three are all the three girls, my three girls. So you select the first one with shift selected on your keyboard, select the final one on that row as they're all the same, and then select the correct tag and just drag across. Now you'll see these have all got tags associated with it. If you put your mouse over it, you can actually see which tag it is these next six I can see they're all selected they're the family ones with all the girls and my wife just drag that tag across so now they've been tagged oops there's an extra one there so you can do single ones and just pull over the single one this one's of my uh, middle girl Casey so you're just simply dragging these tags across and here's one of my, my youngest and now when we go into here, if we want to select double click on these, you can actually just see that we've got the three girls under the Jamie, Casey, Molly. If I wanted to look at the family ones with my wife in as well, double click on this, and we've just got there. So it's you can see now that breaking this down, you can locate images very quickly. Also, what you can do, if you wanted to go further, you could actually at this stage add multiple tags so for, the, for instance in this one here these top three we also know that cases in those so if you wanted to you could drag the casey across there as well so when we now click on casey in here not only are you getting the individual photographs but you're also getting other photographs that she's included in so tagging is a great um, time saving task which i would recommend anyone doing this is another screencast from VideoElements.com.